Hey guys, welcome to the ultimate pan fishing tutorial video. Today I will be showing you how to easily catch panfish. Uh, you can do this in pretty much any small stream, even like large lakes around, along the banks. Um, the first thing you're going to need is some basic fishing line. Um, anything from like 3 to 10 pounds will work beautifully. We got, this is 10 pound test, but pretty much anything works well. Then, uh, if you want, you can throw on a bobber to that. Uh, there's a bunch of different kinds. I, I don't tend to use bobbers. These are mostly optional. Uh, but they can be helpful depending on the rod you're using. I, speaking of rods, I use a dock demon. I'll put up a picture for you. And they're pretty cheap. Very good for a gift for your youngins or uh, any angler for in fresh water. It's good for bass, too. Um, the main way I try to catch panfish is by using a jig head, which they vary in sizes. Usually I use a jig head, which usually look along the lines of this. Usually I use a smaller one, but this works. And then I put either a um, curly tail swim bait, soft plastic, or I try to use something like this, which is a baby shad. And they both work decently well. The way you put them on is you just thread the bait onto the hook. Try not to poke yourself. Just thread it onto the hook. Make sure it gets over this part right here, this little lip here. That'll keep it on there. And then this will as you reel it back, it'll flap its tail, and it'll really attract the fish and make it look like it's actually swimming. If this doesn't work, you could always tie on a small hook like this, and then put a piece of corn, small piece of hot dog, even like dog food or pet food will work on this. Or you could always use um, a small jig for bass. But as long as the fish can get the hook in its mouth, you pretty much secured the fish. If you want, you can also throw on a weight on there. I would say no bigger than this. And that's the basis of it. Uh, and I'll throw up some pictures of different species of panfish so you can tell the difference. Now it's time to discuss different species of panfish. The main two species that you're going to encounter are most likely going to be bluegill and green sunfish. The difference between them is bluegill have a more round body and like very tiny mouths proportionately. While green sunfish, on the other hand, have surprisingly large mouths and a more slimmer body. 
Other than that, you can find hybrids of the two, uh, crappie, and various other species of sunfish. And I'll throw some pictures up there. This is how you catch a fish in a small freshwater pond. Now, the lure I have on right now is a small, soft plastic swim bait with a jig head. These go together in many different colors. I have used orange, codfish, pretty much anything. If they're more, if it's more murky water, you're gonna want to have a darker lure. If you're going for uh, more shallow and clear water, you're going to want to use uh, lighter colors. So just keep casting. Oh, that's a bite. You might take a few casts, but eventually you should catch a fish. Got one. And that is a simple guide on how to catch small panfish in a freshwater pond. Um, if you want to catch like some smaller, decent sized bass, you might want to uh, use a bigger jig head and or soft plastic. Uh, but this will catch you more fish than that heron over there.